I'm going to be asking out a girl from each country. Where are you from? From here. Would you like to go on a, out on a date? No, thank you. Okay. That's a joke. Well, we crossed off the United States, and now there's only 194 countries to go. I'm from Mexico. I'm from Guatemala. I'm also from Mexico. Would you guys like to go on a date? Oh, <laughs> no, thank you. I have a boyfriend. I have a boyfriend. Okay, yeah, I'll see you, I'll see you around. <laughs> I'm gonna go cry in the bathroom. <laughs> I'm not getting any yeses right now, but I'm going to try a bunch of different methods to secure a date. And once I do, and I'm gonna go to that girl's country to have a date with her. Hopefully it goes well, unlike my last date. I'm recently single. Oh, so really? Still in love with my ex, so. We just asked out a few girls. Uh, the sun is going down, so we're gonna try the clipboard method. I'm just gonna go up to them and say, I work for the, the school. That is a lie. Don't tell this to anyone. Cultural. And if they're from a country that I haven't asked out, I'm gonna ask them out. Is this crazy? Is this weird? <laughs> you be the judge of that. I'm not. Or with UCLA, we're doing a cultural survey. Are you from the United States? Yes, yeah, sorry, I okay. play for me. Oh no, you're all good, you're all good. So we already asked out the United States. We just need a, a different countries. There's actually no diversity. I kept going up to girls and they were all born in the United States. That's until we met... Danielle. Danielle, Manuel, nice yeah. to meet you. Nice. Yeah, Where uh, are you from? I'm from Cuba originally. Oh, that's yeah, cool. yeah, I moved out to LA and I'm here, you know? That's cool, dude, I like it. I don't know, it's pretty shit. Where, where are you from? I'm from Israel. Oh, sick. That's cool. That's yeah. cool. Would you like to go out on a date? No. That, that's uh, fair. I'm dating. Oh, you're dating? Yeah. yeah. No, me too. I don't even... There's so many girls here that I'm sure would like to date someone. Thank you. And you're or... cool, so Oh, why thanks. Not? I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Cheers. Nice meeting Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yes, have a nice course. one. You yeah. Too. Take care. Even though we were having some success at UCLA, it was still taking a really long time to find girls from other countries. And that's when we came up with this next strategy. Yeah, we're at the airport right now. We're at the international side of the airport. And now that I'm here, I'm going to ask out a few girls, hopefully in different countries, because by the end of this video, I will literally fly across the world to go on a date with her. Dude, I don't want to do this. <laughs> I'm so nervous right now. Are you single by any chance? What? Are you single by any chance? Sorry, I don't know. Oh, no. Are, are you from the United States or from where? India. India? Would you like to go out on a date by any chance? No, no, no. Okay, no, no worries. This is not the way to do it. Are you from the United States? No, I'm from New Caledonia. <laughs> That's a country? Yeah. Okay, sorry, I'm like not aware. Uh, would you like to go out on a date? I'm a lesbian. Oh, okay. My mom also. You're from China? That's great. I'm asking girls out at the airport because I'm bored. I was wondering, would you like to go out on a date? Maybe I go to China. You're hungry. I would like to visit. I've heard nothing but great things. The Great Wall of China. Mm -hmm. uh, what else is there? <laughs> There's like a couple other things, you know, like uh, there's so many things. I can't even really think of them, you know, but maybe I can get your Instagram and maybe in the future. Yeah? Okay, cool. Have a good day. Yeah, you too. <laughs> Finally a yes. Especially after all those really painful no's. Remember, after I'm done asking every single country out, we will make a list of all the girls that said yes, and I'm gonna pick one, and I will fly to that girl's country to have a date with her. So, who knows? I might be going to China. So this is a strategy. Talking one-on-one -on -one takes a while, so we're gonna hang a bunch of uh, flyers in the airport and uh, put up, if you're from this country, DM me on Instagram. I don't know if it's gonna work, but you gotta cross off these countries faster, so. After hanging some of those flyers, I started giving them to people, you know, to spread the message faster. This was working great until the police showed up. The police is literally right behind us and I don't know what's gonna happen. But the police had different plans. They saw that I was drinking Era, the sponsor of today's video. And they came up to me and said, I didn't know you were chill like that. And they left me alone. If you also don't want to get arrested, you should get yourself an Air Up right now. Link below. Thank you, Air Up, for saving my life. More on them later. But for now, let's keep crossing these countries off. From the apartment. Hey, that's you, right? Uh, that is me, yeah. Why? Oh, I'm single. I'm looking for a girlfriend from another country. They just left? Yeah. Bro, they don't care. That's awesome. How's it going, ladies? You like one by any chance? No. I'm a single bachelor. I'm actually uh, looking for a girlfriend. So I'm not sure if you know any uh, girls from Andorra. No, I don't know anyone. Anyway, you can give these out to uh, single females. Yeah. I got you. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Yeah. All right, buddy. All right. Oh, okay. All right, I appreciate you, man. No Thank you so much. So we gave uh, some of the papers to the bus drivers. These are the bus drivers that uh, drop off, you know, international people. <laughs> 
Okay guys, so me and Trace are back from the airport. It was pretty successful, I would say. We got one yes, <laughs> and we hung a bunch of flyers that said, if you're from this country, please message me. We finished off the day crossing off a bunch of countries, but my next strategy was even better. I found a bunch of girls on Instagram that had a flag on their bio, and I started calling them. Next up, we have Brazil. Hello. Hello. Are you filming right now? No. Would you like to go on a date in Canada? You want to go on a date to France? Would you like to uh, grab a cup of coffee? Sorry. Vrai sa merg la o inari. Quiero ir a un encontro. Did I say that correctly? Did you understand me? Really? Yes. I mean, that would be pretty cool. <laughs> no. Sing it out. You're a girlfriend? No girlfriend? No. You've been single all this time. Alright, hold on. There's no need to really hammer that point in, okay? Sure. <laughs> okay, great. Well, good talking to you. I'm gonna, you know, call my mom and tell her the good news. Okay. <laughs> yes, bye. <laughs> So she does have a boyfriend. Let's fucking go. Damn, she's real cool, man. I, um. Yeah, she's really cool. Well, I don't think this day could get any better, but we still have a lot of countries left. Luckily, I brought in some help. This is my friend Aiden. Hey guys, Aiden here. In these past few days, I have gotten together, as you can see in these slides, over 100 girls from every single country in the world. We're going to add all of them to a group chat, and Manuel is going to ask out all of these women at the exact same time. And as he continues to do that, I'll be crossing off the remaining countries. I'm going to call my friend Angie. She's a Argentinian YouTuber. Angie, um, we've been on these calls multiple times. We, we've talked a good bit. I see the way you kind of look at me. Uh, insert. Anyways, I know you're in Argentina. I was wondering if you would want to go on a date. Tengo novia, Manuel. I'm okay with that. We can maybe go, <laughs> maybe go on, on a date. No. No, like, no. All, all, okay, no, listen, like, I'm not the. All three of us, we can. I forget that I said it. I was I was joking. That was a joke. Um, it's not one of my fantasies. Okay, cool. Yeah, no worries. Um, well, <laughs> well, no way. <wait. laughs> well, I asked her out. She said no because she has a girlfriend. So then I asked her if she knows anyone else from Argentina, and she said yes. Long story short, Angie's trying to get another friend of hers that lives in Argentina on the call. And now I'm getting nervous again. No, no, saca el peluche, saca el peluche. Hello. Hello. Vega. Eh, Manuel, ella es mi amiga de Argentina. Es youtuber también. Hola, Mika. Mi Mika, ¿hace videos? Sí, qué pregunta. De qué? I apologize. I forgot that I was filming a video in English. That's what happens when you're asking beautiful women out from other countries. You start speaking their language. Anyways, we were talking just small talk, and then eventually I asked her the question. Si, si quieres ir a una cita, te uh, doy este dragón. Me encantaría. Qué, qué bueno, qué bueno. Perfecto. Acá estaré. Okay. Yo aquí voy a estar. Okay, okay. Okay. Nice to meet you. Yes, nice meeting you. Adios. Se enamoró de mí, ¿no? Yeah, I couldn't complain. We were getting closer to finally asking out a girl from every single country, but we still had a few more countries to go. We're at Tyler's house right now. We're about to call Jamaica. Hey. This is actually not someone from Jamaica. It's uh, Tyler's sister. She is from Lebanon, though, so that that's good. What the f***? How are you? That's my sister. Wanna go on a date? Just me and you. Not your boyfriend. Oh, I believe Thank we got- Thank God! Wait, hold on, no, we got disconnected. We got disconnected. No, she hung up! And that's a yes from Lebanon, and now moving on to the next two countries. I found someone from North Korea, her name is Jaomi Park. I found her through the Joe Rogan podcast, and I DM'd We'll see if she gets back to me. One person did get back to me from Cuba. Her name's Anita. I saw her story, so I just swiped up, and I just said, You want me? She responded by saying negative in Spanish. So then I said, racist. Not being able to go back to my country because I kind of f***ed up the pickup line. That sucks. 
or we're gonna keep going on other countries now. It's been a very long journey. 195 countries and now we only have two left. I should probably tell you that after countless group chats that Aiden dropped my dating profile in, we only got two responses. This guy said, welcome friend. And this woman said, very nice picture. That's a like right there. Thank you. So it's fair to say that the group chat strategy just doesn't work. And with that, we come to the final two girls on the list. Manuela, <laughs> uh, if I'm ever in Argentina, would you like to go on a date? Yeah. Cool, cool. Well, I'll see you around in the yeah. world. All right, that's another yes. <sighs> Next up, we have Madison. She is from the Philippines. Why, where are you <laughs> right now? Looks like you've been kidnapped. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Would you like to go on a date by any chance? Yes, of course. Okay, cool. Well, I'm gonna be. I'm booking a flight tomorrow. <sighs> <laughs> I said that as a joke, but it might be coming true because out of all the countries that said yes I selected 10 and between me and my friends We're going to pick which country I will fly to to have a date with for the last couple of days I've been asking out a girl from every country here are the top 10 What does the lucky winner get uh, they get a date with me and I'm gonna give them an air up the sponsor of today's video Woo! Woo! Number one Brazil oh, yeah. All right, next so up Manuel hey. I think this would be great because of her name, obviously. Yeah, pro. that's you. Uh, another pro, she would make a great mom, I think. Why, Why do you I'm think so? I don't know, I just get the feel. Next up. <laughs> Damn! Wow! Winner! United Kingdom. Oh, no. Alright, moving on. I'm Fuck. <laughs> Bro, I think she might be my soulmate. I don't I, think, no, I think so. Con, she's Tyler's sister. Of yeah. course, yes. Uh, How are we feeling about Sam? Like, horrible. Okay. Terrible. I say go for it. <laughs> Madison. She's hot. <laughs> Argentina. Wait, you know already had Argentina. I know, I got f***ed up. I don't think she's the one for you, personally. You sure, bro? <laughs> yeah. China. China. Yeah, China. I've noticed that you've stopped putting names. Isn't that a little f***ed up? I will say I was really tired when I did the slideshow. <laughs> And I'm gonna give you guys time to pick. As the boys are helping me pick who I'm going to go on a date with, I wanna tell you a little bit more about our sponsor, Aero. I'm between Philippines and Argentina. Manuela. 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 I'm team Manuela. These little scent pods right here trick your brain into thinking you're drinking something really sweet, something good. But in all reality, it's actually just water. I think I've been drinking significantly more water ever since I got an Aero water bottle. Arena is definitely very nice looking. Yeah, I'm really wondering what the boys are gonna pick. Bella, Indonesia, China. Endless possibilities. <laughs> kind of like Arabs, flavors. Not endless, but they have a lot of flavor. It's kind of, it's kind of cool. I like this girl a lot. I think this is, she's gonna be good. This is great. Yeah, this is a great pick for me. Also, the holidays are coming up. It's the perfect gift for yourself or maybe for family. But get one for yourself first so you can really see what you're getting yourself into. These things are freaking amazing. They've been changing the way I drink water. And then once you get it for yourself, you should probably get some for your family and friends. But, but, but give yourself this gift. You deserve it. You deserve to drink water that tastes like peach. You can quote me on that. Right now they're running a holiday special. You can save up to 30% off if you get it right now. Link in the description. It's time. All right, boys. We all unanimously decided on one person. Yeah, yeah. Lebanon. Not kidding. <laughs> Manuel. The boys picked uh, Manuela. I'm not going with Manuela. It has nothing to do with her. But from the moment I started this, I've felt the most nervous I've felt in a, in a really long time. And out of all the girls that I talked to, the one that I felt the most comfortable with and not nervous was And after 16 hours of flying, I had arrived at my destination. <laughs> I'm at an Airbnb <laughs> in another country. I can't believe I actually did this. <laughs> it's like, why? I, I literally flew across the world for a date. I don't even know this girl that much. <laughs> also, she doesn't even know I'm, I'm here. I haven't told her. I'm going to be meeting up with one of her friends <laughs> soon. And we're gonna talk about setting up the date. This is a jump cut. I'm here with uh, with Angie. Hello. 
My name is Angie. I'm from Argentina. If you guys remember, I asked out Angie. She said, Tengo novia, Manuel. And then she um she had a friend who was single. And so. Alright, that's fire. Her friend's Mika, she doesn't know that I'm here and I'm gonna go on a date with her. What are you going to do tomorrow? This is you and this is her. Wow. She had a lot of boobs. <laughs> Don't see her boobs. It's weird. <laughs> with Angie's help, we were setting up the perfect date. But to do that, we needed three things. Number one, a Harry Potter book. She likes Harry Potter? I have a Harry Potter book. I bought one just for this. I haven't watched a single movie about Harry Potter. Number two, her favorite meal. She likes Big Mac, McDonald's. And number three, I need a new clothes because according to Angie, I look horrible. After we got done shopping, Angie and Brie were helping me set up where the date was gonna take place. And we needed to hurry because Angie texted Mika asking her to meet up. We got 20 minutes until she comes. But Mika has no idea that she's actually coming to have a date with me. I'm pretty nervous, but I'm already here, so I can't really like hide or anything. So I'm just gonna uh, change. But I'm terrified. It's not because I'm in a different country or because Mika is significantly out of my league. I just haven't been in a date in a really long time. My last date, to be honest with you, ended horribly. And after that, I was just like, well, I'm not gonna try ever again. Hopefully this date goes well. And if not, I'm going to retire for the rest of time. And I'm probably going to live in a forest alone somewhere. And I'm going to raise a wolf. We just wait. No. How do you think it's gonna go? Te tengo fe, te tengo fe. Igualmente. Sí, si quieres, uh, siéntate. Bienvenida a esta casa. ¿Cuándo llegaste? Yo vivo acá, por, en la cuadra. ¿No vivías en.? No. No volé para acá. Ah. Eso sería yo... medio extraño. Yo hablando. Claro, claro. Medio. Mija no lo dice porque le da vergüenza, pero vino a verte. Ay. Allá. ¿Nos casamos? Creo que sí. Ah. Oh, perdón, mi. Libros. Dejé mi libro ahí. Qué extraño. ¿Te gusta Harry Potter? Sí, sí, me encanta. ¿Cuál es tu personaje favorito? Ah, también tengo tantos. ¿A ti cuál es tu favorito? Hermione. Ese me encanta. Perdón. Soy muy sarcástico. Cuando okay. me pongo nervioso, me pongo más sarcástico. ¿Estás nervioso? Bien nervioso, siendo sincero. Me dejó, mira justo la Big Mac, que es tu favorita. Mi favorita. ¿Cómo sabías eso? ¿Cuántas es casas? Yo no sé cómo se hace. Digamos que tú estás hermosa youtuber. Sí. ¿Y algo más? Y toco el piano. ¿Tocas el piano? Sí. That's a lie. I actually have no idea how to play the piano. But Mika does. So, to impress her, I'm going to pretend to play the piano. ¿Has visto este piano? <laughs> no, <laughs> ya. Voy a tocar ahora. A ver. Bien, bien. Estaba súper nervioso, siendo sincero. ¿En serio? Sí, odiaba, odio los cuando me pongo nervioso. Sí, pero you're you're a pretty show person. Uh, you're cool. You know. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. yeah, yeah. You too. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You make the date feel a lot less nerve wracking. Oh, ah, yeah. okay, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Si pasas por Estados Unidos, mi casa es tu casa. Y vos en acá en Argentina también. Te... Entonces eres mi novia de Argentina. Está muy bien. Yo soy tu. Mi novio de Estados Unidos. Mi novio 
Antonio Cubano de Estados Unidos. <laughs> Thank you, Era, for sponsoring today's video. Mika and Angie absolutely loved it. Link in the description to get your own. And if you guys like this video, I think you'll absolutely love this one.